Greetings folks. I'm here to talk about why I think somebody within the Postal Service pilfered my box. And it's kind of sad because I've been selling online since about 1995 and I've probably shipped over 10,000 packages through the Postal Service. But as of late, you know, I hear a lot of stories from folks uh, in the neighborhood that their mail gets mixed up and so forth and I never thought I'd get affected by some of the mishaps but apparently it was my turn. So here's what happened. Somebody shipped me this box. Now this came from Greensboro, North Carolina 27455. I'm in Miami, Florida 33129. This box is filled, or was filled actually, with audio tapes. Kind of like these right here. Now, these are a little heavy. These are old reel-to-reel uh, -reel tapes. And they have music on them. They were shipped via media mail. Postage was $9.31. Now this is the kind of label right here uh, that you would get at the post office. You can't just like, uh, you know, buy this at the supermarket or print this out yourself. This is the, the Pitney Bowes type of label that you get at the post office from their machine. And there's the delivery confirmation label. Now, why is this important? Well, this was shipped via media mail. This box was sealed with the tamper-proof tape that you actually stick to the box that you have to wet. When I got the box, it was empty. Look at the back of the box. The tamper-proof tape had been cut, and the box was taped over with priority mail tape. Now, there isn't a postal clerk on the planet that will let you ship a box via media mail with priority mail tape on it. So this happened within the post office. Now when I called the post office, the first thing out of their mouth was, did you have insurance? Well, that's pretty sad. So I have to get insurance to prevent theft of my stuff from your own people? I understand if a uh, package is damaged somehow, uh, it's uh, totally lost, or you know, it's stolen from a doorstep or whatever. But obviously, somebody took the time to retape this box. If they took the time to retape this box and it was damaged while in the hands of the Postal Service, why didn't they pick up the contents of the box and throw it back in the box? That seems like common sense. So, I'm kind of upset about this. Um, I do have a case number, which I'm not going to read to you guys because I don't want all of you calling and, you know, stirring stuff up. So, I called it in on Friday. I was told it would take about two days for the postal inspector to get back to me. I still haven't heard back from them. And we'll see what happens. But this is kind of sad. I want to see what excuse they're going to give me to wipe their hands of this because that's not cool at all. Thanks for your time.